Hello, I'm Jamie Stallcup, Associate Editor of TV Kids, and I have the pleasure of speaking with Tim Fetterly, creator, showrunner, and executive producer of the Disney Plus show, High School Musical, The Musical, The Series. So what set season four apart from the previous three? It's the finale. So, you know, it, 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 a lot of the stories we've been teasing for a long time, we pay off this season. It's our biggest, most meta season. We've got OG Wildcats back. The premise is that Disney is shooting High School Musical 4 at East High while the real life kids are putting on High School Musical 3 as their senior musical. It's insane. But um, uh, what, what really sets it apart, I think, is our, our tribute to the fans for sticking with us for four amazing seasons and, uh, and, the, and longtime viewers getting some answers on some big emotional things. What drove the decision to drop all episodes at once for this last season? And do you hope that viewers binge it all back to back or would you prefer they savor it and take it slow? I think the business person in me would love them to binge it because uh, that's the streaming reality. I think the creative in me would love to see people savor it. And uh, uh, w what drove the decision? Some of that's programming that I'm not as involved in. But what's interesting, because the series helped launch Disney Plus, we started as a Wednesday night fall release. Then we became like a Friday night, I think winter release. Then we were a Friday night summer release or, uh, or maybe it's reversed. It was Friday, then Wednesdays. The point being uh, the streaming era is a little bit the wild west and the series has, has uh, uh, bounced around a little bit with how it's presented. And I think ultimately for a final season, I'm hoping people binge it. Do you have the ending of the show planned out from the beginning? And in general, how did your vision evolve over the course of the show? You know, I always knew the show would end thematically on the note of we're better together, we're all in this together, taking a bow as a group is more important than being a star. I think the way the show evolved over the years was both cast members coming and going uh, and also seeing, you know, did certain actors have more chemistry with each other? I was able to tell with my writers and the directors and the cast, of course, stories about identity and anxiety and children of divorce. And we were able to actually go more places than I thought we'd maybe be able to go on Disney when we started. And uh, and no regrets. Like, I'm very uh, grateful and proud of the stories we ended up really telling. And in terms of music, in the past seasons, you've had some songs written by cast members. Can yeah. you tell us anything about what to expect in terms of music for this last season? Some of my favorite music we've ever done, of course, lots of High School Musical 3 covers, uh, some amazing new songs, including from Cozy Zulsdorf and, uh, uh, gosh, Jaheem. It, there's so many great new songs. Uh, Joshua Bassett co-writes a new song this season, which is fantastic and is a duet a lot of people have been asking for for a long time. I'm not going to say anything more on that. Uh, but I, I always think our the music in the latest season is my favorite music, and I think this is now my favorite music. And there's some tear jerkers and some roof razors and uh, some just really fun covers from the original movies. And what was it like to film back in Salt Lake City, considering last season was at a summer camp and outside? It was a homecoming. It really was. We love that crew so much. They've become a second family to us, people from out of town. And it was really special to be back in Salt Lake and really stop and pause and reflect on how lucky we were to, to shoot the show at all, let alone four seasons. Salt Lake is, is scenically beautiful. The people are very kind. It was a real homecoming. Well, thank you so much for your time today, Tim. Thank you, Jamie. Such a Season pleasure. Season four sounds very exciting. Thank you. I appreciate it. You take care.